Hi there, I'm SmallAnt1 and welcome to my advanced strategy tutorial. In this video, I'll be explaining Snowdram, which is an incredibly difficult strat that jumps to the Painting Moon in Snow Kingdom to save up to 7 seconds. Snowdram involves a small reroute in Snow Kingdom before the strat is even done. After falling down into Shiveria and collecting the moon in the corner, go straight for the bounce up to the chest up above and skip the shot for now. Go through the kingdom as usual until after finishing the Goomba Room. After leaving the pipe, go to the shop, buy the moon, and warp to the Odyssey. Back at the Odyssey, do a spin pound jump, cap throw, and dive to get on top. This is where Snowdram starts. Mario will jump from the Odyssey onto the platform with the Painting Moon. You'll need to land slightly left of the corner here, so keep that in mind while I'm explaining. To set up Snowdram, have Mario stand with his left foot along the metal like this. Now go into first person mode with R3 and line up the left side of this icon to be inside this loop on the Odyssey. Once that's all set up, you can do the jump. Leave first person mode, throw Cappy, jump, and ground pound. Once the ground pound animation starts, hold left on the control stick. When Mario hits the ground, initiate a roll and continue holding left. Mario should vault from the left side of Cappy. Keep holding left until Mario is here, then point straight towards the corner that Mario needs to land on. Let Mario fall for just a moment, then cap throw. You want to throw Cappy right when the top of Mario's head drops just below the middle of the screen. Let Mario do the full spin animation for the cap throw, then dive. Once Mario does the cap jump, you'll need to do a rainbow spin to stall in the air when Cappy returns to Mario by pressing a jump button. The rainbow spin needs to be delayed as much as possible. Don't do it right as Cappy returns. Wait for a short moment to press the jump button. After the rainbow twirl, do another cap throw immediately. Wait for Mario to do the full spin animation, and then dive onto the platform. Everything during this strat is very precise. You have to cap throw at just the right time. You have to dive just as the animation ends so Mario doesn't lose any height. The rainbow spin has to be delayed just enough. The second cap throw needs to be done immediately after the rainbow spin. And the dive, again, needs to be timed perfectly so Mario doesn't lose any height. All of that needs to be done all while on the perfect line to the spot you need to land. There is very little room for error. Snowdram may take you hours to get it the first time, and will take hours and hours of practice afterwards to get consistent. It is possible to be consistent at though, so don't get discouraged. Once you can get on the platform though, roll boost and roll cancel to open up the chest and collect the moon. After the moon, spin pound roll and jump back down to the Odyssey to finish off the kingdom. That's about all there is to Snowdram. If I forgot any details, or if you have any helpful tips, feel free to leave them in the comments below, they are much appreciated. Thank you for watching, be sure to like and subscribe, I'm SmallAnt1, and I'll see you next time.